Everyone seems to be raving about Disney's latest cash cow TV show, She-Hulk, for one reason or another. And who else better to discuss it than I, someone who has not seen a single episode? You see, She-Hulk's been rustling a few jimmies lately, and I'm going to settle this dispute by defending She-Hulk. And don't worry, I'm not gonna do the lazy, she's a woman, therefore it's automatically good argument. No, 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 these are real, solid facts. Reason number one, she's green. Ever since I was a hatchling, green was always my favorite color. Lloyd, Shrek, Mally, the best waifu. You just can't go wrong with a color like green. Reason number two, the CGI. So in case you haven't noticed, the CGI in She-Hulk is god-awful. It, it's butt ugly. It looks like a sleep paralysis demon ate a goat and then spat it out and then ate it. I don't know. What I'm trying to say is she's terrifying. She's this giant skinless just things, this mass of stuff walking around and like, like wobbling around and like, it, it's creepy. But you see, that's a good thing. This way they can save their budget on bigger and better projects like Secret Wars and Kang Dynasty. I mean, do you want the next Avengers movie to look like this? Didn't think so! I mean, sure, they could have saved money by not using CGI every five goddamn seconds and filmed an actual scene in a real room for once, but no, we want everything to look sparkly and shiny. Reason number three, it's different. She-Hulk, unlike her very male predecessor, she didn't have to control her anger and learn to, uh, formulate rage and uh, not go all crazy and kill a bunch of people by accident and everything. Clearly, why, I mean, redo that when you can just have her instantly learn all her powers and how they work immediately. Who cares about dealing with the consequences and repercussions of something when you can just have fun and, you know, not do that and, ah, oh, look, it's Megan the Stallion, yay! Yay! Reason number four. She is an attorney. She-Hulk is a lawyer, but not like a, a serious lawyer. No, no, a goofy, fun lawyer, because what's more goofy and fun than getting a car accident? I mean, we've already had one hard-boiled lawyer in the MCU. <laughs> we don't need two, because, I mean, when have they ever reused an idea before, right? Why have a series that explores crooked politicians, false accusations, and wrongful imprisonment when we can just have a bunch of wacky shenanigans? Yay! And finally, reason number five. I am a DC fan. Yep, you heard me right. I like DC more than Marvel. I've got nothing against the Marvel, I mean Spider-Verse is one of my all-time favorite movies, but they've had the limelight for far too long, it's time someone else took the stage. Or I guess in other words, this does put a smile on my face. Hey, should the next Avengers movie be a bit more small-scale, you know, starting from scratch again with more of an emphasis on character and legacy and the next generation of Avengers? Nah, let's just do the multiverse. That'll, that'll go well. That's not gonna be too complicated. God.